Here's why I woke you up. I'm the oldest of four siblings, two sisters and a brother. We've all lived here a very, very long time. It was... it was nice. Real nice. We all got along, helped each other, made this place beautiful together. <sighs> well, all that's gone now. They all went crazy, been fighting each other for years. I tried everything I could to stop them, but I couldn't do it. This wasn't strong enough. Back before this, we all had equal parts of this place. Now all I've got is this beach. They've taken over everything else I looked after. But I don't really care about that. I just want them to stop fighting. And Scully, that's where you come in. I'm too weak to do much of anything now, so I need you to get close to them. Throw them off guard. Subdue them if it comes to that, because that'll give me a chance to talk some sense into them. If I can, well, I got another plan for that too, just in case. I'm not gonna lie to you. It isn't gonna be easy. But if we can do this, I promise you, I'll help you cross the sea and you can go wherever you want after that. We'll go see my youngest sister first. Her name's Wanda. She will not be happy to see us. See these things? They're everywhere on the island. Bubbling clay pools with magic just oozing out of them. I made you out of one of these, and you can use any one of them to help you out. What? Ah, oh, come on! There was a perfectly good path here. Nice, flat ground, lots of dirt, some beautiful rocks. Why'd she have to ruin it with something this stupid and idiotic? <sighs> Looks like we have to find another way in. Let's go through the path on the right. Maybe there'll be some nice rocks over there. This is what I was worried about. Much tougher way through here. Lots of stuff blocking the paths. Wish I could help you more, Scully, but I'm too weak to do much of anything besides showing you the way. Can't even move a lousy hill anymore. It's embarrassing. Huh? Why is it doing that? Did I make it do that? Hey, Scully! Go roll onto that clay pool and see what it does. You'll be okay. At least I hope so. Wow! Holy wow! That's some kind of power behind that punch! Oh no, not these things. Look out, Scully, they're trouble. Hang on, I think you can take them. Use the big guy and let him have it. Okay. <laughs> 
I haven't been here in years. This place used to be mine too. It was less wet than it is now. Covered in sand and dirt, and more rocks. Good ones. I liked those rocks. Wormy blobs are so annoying. They just bumble around causing problems. They started showing up here a while back. Probably something to do with all the fighting. Magic's been leaking out everywhere since it all started. And that isn't good for anyone. Wanda's domain is real close. Here we are, Scully. Wanda's domain. <sighs> How did she manage to get more water in here? Watch out for these things, Scully. They guard Wanda's territory and they'll slap you across the river before you know what hit you. Trust me on that. Ugh, my chest hurts just thinking about it. We're doing good, Scully, real good. 
I don't want to tip off Wanda until we get to her central chamber. Oh, right! I haven't told you what we're doing yet! Okay, each one of us has our own central chamber. It's like, it's like our home, our most special place. I wonder how mine's doing. Sorry, Scully, got a little lost there. Anyway, you don't enter a central chamber unless you've been invited. It's very, very rude, and you can bet on the owner showing up to find out what's going on. Puts us all out of sorts, too. It's the best spot for us to do what we need to do, Scully. It's also not the safest plan. You could say it's the opposite, and you know now that I'm saying it out loud, it doesn't sound like a very good plan at all. But trust me, Scully, I know what I'm doing, I think. of all this water, but I've always liked these water spouts. Wanda could always make me smile with a few of these flying through the air. They're still dangerous, Scully, so be careful around them. You know, Scully, it's harder than I thought being back here. Wanda and I, we... We were really close. When she was little, she loved tagging along with me on all sorts of trips around here. I was after rocks. She loved the streams. She always found the best rocks for me. <sighs> when things went bad for all of us, I really thought we'd stick together. Shows what I know. Scully, is it me, or did it just get real cloudy around here? Just bringing the entire river down on us! Go, go, go! Whoa! 
More water? We didn't have enough already? We can't go back the way we came. Let's see if we can find a way through here. about another tidal wave, don't. She'll need to rest up after using that much power. Isn't that right? I know you're listening. Oh, don't worry. I'll wash away you and that pet you brought soon enough. Yeah, you do that. And Scully's my friend, not a pet. Try to be considerate for once. Scully, I'm glad you kept quiet and didn't sink to her level. Shows real maturity on your part. so much water. It's hard to cross, it turns dirt into sludge, and even worse, it washes away all the nice rocks. Terrible! Huh? Another one? How'd I do that again? Hey, Scully! Go over there and check that out! Genius. I knew I could do it. We're really rolling now. Back on track, Scully. About time, too. I think I finally dried out after that nice hospitality we got. What did you think would happen, Terry? Did you think I just stopped being mad at you? I'm the one that should be mad at you. You took everything from me. All my lands, all that dirt, all those great big rocks, gone. What choice did I have? You wouldn't help me. You're just like Brent and Fiona. I'm nothing like them, or you.
realize how much good I could do if I had it? Ending droughts, reforming the glaciers. I could sustain everything, Terry. And tear right through our family to get it. They have no idea what they're doing. Neither do you. Oh, you think you're so smart. You've always been such a know-it-all. Because it's true! here, Scully. Nice going. We're in the heart of Wanda's domain now, Scully. That means, surprise, surprise, even more water. You gotta be careful of showers in these caves. Staying in one for a stretch will not be good for you. Too bad, because you're going to whether you like it or not. Go away! No! I won't! If you take one step inside my chamber, I'll- Do what? Come out and give me a big hug? Talk with me about the weather? Oh, oh, will you give me a new rock? Ah, just leave me alone! I tell you we're close, Scully, but I think you already knew that. Say goodbye to your little pet, Terry! Don't listen to her, Scully! You can do this!
She's really teetering now! Come on, Scully, keep going! Crossing into Brent's territory now. He lives up, way up. Very tricky to get to, even with what you can do. He's a bit. Terry! Oh my goodness! Here! Here! Different. I haven't seen you since I blasted you off my mountain 10 or 20 or 30 or 40 years ago! Sounds about right. What brings you up here again? Did you enjoy what happened the last time? No, I didn't, Brent. I... Would you like another ride? No, I wouldn't, Brent. I... Okay, let me know if you change your mind. I probably won't. We'll talk later! So, oh, that's Brent. I never liked coming this way. No good rocks. None for- Okay, I'm back! Terry! Yes? What brings you up here? I think we both- and what is that? Holy marble thing you brought? That's Scully. <laughs> Wait, I remember why I blasted you off my mountain. Uh, you did? You were supposed to help me and didn't. That's not good. That's not good at all. Brent- We'll talk later. I'll be back. Yeah, none of this is going to be easy, is it? You've probably noticed that Brent marches to a, uh, different tune. He joined in on this mess because he didn't want to miss all the fun, as he puts it. I don't even think he knows why everyone's fighting. Let me out of here! And there she is! Still mad! What a surprise! I swear, Terry, I'm gonna... You're gonna do nothing and like it, because you're not going anywhere, got it? Good. I'll be here when you're ready to talk to me. Hey, Terry. Terry! Terry! What? I'm back! I know, I can hear- I'm still a bit mad at you. I'm sorry, Brent, but I didn't want to help you bury our sisters in an earthquake. Wait, there's a little bit more moisture coming from you than I'm used to? Well, that's because Wanda- Is that Wanda with you? Uh, yes. Hi, Wanda! Hi, Brent. Are we still fighting, too? Yes, Brent. Okay, I'll deal with you a little later. <laughs> Same old Brent. Yeah. He's calmer than usual. Yes? Are you still here? Have you been blasted off my mountain yet? Brent, we're not even there yet. Okay, I'll try harder. <laughs> this is probably not gonna work. Hey, Brent, look, I just wanna talk, okay? Nothing funny or tricky, just talking, promise. Brent, did you- Okay! What? Yes, let's have a chat. Why didn't you say so before? Well, you kept interrupting. I'm happy to have a talk. Come to my central chamber. That's great. I'll see you soon. Well, I was not expecting that. Oh boy. See, 
seeing it up close, I forgot how tall Brent's Mountain was. It's gonna be real tough to get up there, Scully. Huh. Another one? Hey, Scully, roll over there and check that out. Great job, Scully. Now let's get up that mountain. Oh, great. How are we supposed to get up there? I don't think you can jump that high, Scully. Whoa! You can lift those? Yes, that's great! I can't believe how good I am at this. You can get anywhere now. I'm a genius. Sure you are. What was that? Nothing. Watch out for these things, Scully. You get in their way, and they'll send you for a real ride. Terry! Yes? What? Terry! Brent, I can hear you! Oh, good! I just wanted to know if you were close. Yeah, Brent, we're nearly- Great! I'll see you soon! I wish he'd stop- Terry! What? Be careful! It can get pretty windy up here. Yeah, Brent, I know- Okay, see you when you get here! Ugh. actually reason with Brent. Convince him to help me stop all this. <laughs> oh, ready to chime in now, are we? You are so dense. What? You really don't know him at all. You never did. I think I know him better than you. You just smashed tidal waves at him. He wants to win this fight just as much as anyone. No, he doesn't. He's just being Brent. He really is, Terry. What's that supposed to mean? Fine, stop talking. Scully, I'm really starting to miss my beach.
It looks like someone has come by for a visit. Why here? This is where you landed. Yes. The worst possible spot. Yes. <laughs> Scully, that's Fiona. And we're in a lot of trouble. for me, Terry. Fell right into my lap. That's no fun. Let's give you some exercise before I burn you up. Or you could just, you know, not do that? <laughs> you know you can't talk to her when she gets like this. Thanks for the advice! Oh, and why didn't you warn us about Brent? Oh, I don't know, Terry. Maybe because I'm in a jar and you put me there? Ugh! Ugh, these things are grumpy and tough, Scully. They pack a real punch. You'll need to use the big guy to stand up to him. Fiona, just come out so we can talk. You're not listening. Oh, is that my little sister's voice I hear? Um, which would be better for you right now? Yes or no? <laughs> of course. She always did like to follow you around, lapping up every tall tale and made up yarn you could come up with. Hey, some of them were true. And look where it got you, Wanda. Tucked away in his little pouch like one of those stupid rocks he's always talking about. My rocks are not stupid! It's all well and good. At least I can deal with both of you now. After I've had my food. We're <laughs> in trouble. Oh, you think? What is that? Whoa! Watch out, Scully!
Time for some fun. Look out behind you. <laughs> Scully, get rolling! Do I want to know what's going on? No, you really don't. here did we get out well sort of why do i smell burning wood uh the forest is on fire the forest is on fire <laughs> <laughs> call me crazy but i don't think your plan is working out very well says the one in the jar uh, did you think i'd let you go that easily you or that little pebble you brought along what is it with all of them? Scully's a reanimated skull covered in magical clay. How is that so hard to understand? That's the thing you're gonna focus on? It's just so delicious to see you so humbled. A far cry from every other time we've talked. Hey! That's why I didn't even bother asking you for help. I knew you'd say no. You always do. How could I have said yes to this? Look around! Look at what you're doing to our home! That's always been your problem, Terry. You could never see things any other way but yours. Yeah? Well, that may be, but your vision is really, really bad. <laughs> wow, you really got it. Oh, don't you start. Another glowing pool? Huh. Uh, Scully? What are you doing? Whoa! So, uh, you can throw your own head. You can what? That's amazing! <laughs> Scully, you really are something special. Fiona! Hey, look, I didn't mean to crash into your home like this. I'm sorry. Scully's sorry too. Can we just, you know, stop all this and talk? Hmm. No. That's it? Just no? I know why you're here, Terry. I heard you coming as soon as you left your beach. You've been banging and crashing around the island like you own the place. That's what you always do. That was mostly Scully. Please. Did you think I wouldn't notice? Well, what else was I supposed to do? It's the only way I could get a chance to talk! Uh, yes, yes, I know. We all know. You just wanna talk. Who do you take me for? Even I didn't think you were that arrogant. Or, do you just have Wanda in that jar for fun? It is not fun. Wanda! You plan on putting me in that thing, too. You want to stop me. Stop me from doing some real, actual good with the life heart. It's so selfish of you. What, you gonna burn down all the other force, too? A means to an end, Terry. You'll see. <laughs> That last part didn't sound great. Neither did the rest of it. You all really think I'm that arrogant? You're asking me this now? Well? I don't think you want the answer to that. I was just looking out for you! You never took any of us seriously, Terry. Not really. Yeah. Well, you really showed me, didn't you? Yeah, guess we did. 
Is it bothering you that Fiona just got really quiet? I was trying not to think about it. I can see a way through there, Scully. Great. Back in the volcano. Huh. This place looks real familiar. Be careful, Scully. anywhere. Are you asking the sister you have imprisoned in a jar, or your friend a rolling skull who can't talk? Good point. You know... What? That was too easy. Are you serious? Fiona could have made it a lot harder for us to get out. She didn't even fight, she just left. Almost as if... She wanted us up here. Yeah, but why? I bet we'll find out when we get back outside. She always liked putting on a show. Uh... What? What now? Why did you make it so boring in here? Couldn't you have put in a few ferns or something? Sorry, Wanda. I'll make sure the next magically sealed prison I create comes with a full set of plants for you to look after. Thanks, that would be great. <laughs> What's so funny? I just... I just keep thinking about what she would say if she could see us all now. Don't. Probably would only take her a few words to calm everything Stop, down. Stop, I can't. Then we'd all laugh and go for a walk through the woods. Stop it, Terry! She's gone, and she's not coming back! No, I guess she isn't. That's not gonna keep me from remembering her. Wanda? Wanda? Wanda! Ow, what? 
What would it take for me to convince you to stop fighting? I don't know, Terry. Everyone seems to to fix things. I can't believe you just don't see that. But, Wanda, you're tearing our home apart, hurting our brother and sister. You think I like fighting Brent and Fiona? I hate it. They, they just... Don't understand? Yeah. You know, if I asked them, I bet they'd give me the same answer about you. It doesn't make you right. It doesn't make any of you right. There you go again, talking like you know better. You're just not listening. I don't think any of you are either. Doesn't mean I won't keep trying, though. No, I imagine it won't. Stubborn no <laughs> Well, you're right about the first part. I don't think I said this yet, but thank you for helping me and for listening. It's been, it's been nice. I mean, you could work on not interrupting me as much, but you're a good friend. It's been tough, but I know you've got my back and that makes me feel like we've got a shot at pulling this off.
Ah! All I'm saying, Terry, is that I don't think we're going to need Zach's optimal way to get there. Stop talking! Just stop talking! And if you turn left instead of right at the fork back there, you would have shaved about 23 seconds You off. can't even see! How do you know? I hear really well. Ow! Hey, stop that! There's more where that came from if you don't shut up. Harry, listen to me. We can still talk. I think you made it really clear, Wanda, that you don't want to talk to me unless it's right before you hit me with a tidal wave. Yes, keep it to yourself, Wanda. You've been such a big help already. Don't you have some kindling to blow on? Don't you have puddles to tend to? Hag! No! Hey! Remember, I can shake the jar whenever I want. Keep testing me. Go on. Scully's gone. Gone? Where? Gone. Just another knife in my back. Can... Can you go get it? Of course! Really? No! It's just... And the limestone has been... All my rocks! What have you done to my central chamber?! What? Nothing? Nobody wants to fess up?! You didn't have to do any of that. The rocks weren't hurting anyone. They weren't in the way. You ruined my home out of spite. Why did I ever bother trying to reason with any of you? What a waste of time.
whole time. And you kept it from all of us. Of course I did. Even before we started fighting? <laughs> I knew it! You hid it from us! You never deserved to know where it was. None of you did. I always knew you were a selfish liar, Terry. I saw what was happening before any of you lifted a finger. Why do you think I wanted us to build that statue together? I was trying to save us from this. Do you honestly think any of us would believe that? After all of this? You wanted the life heart all along, didn't you? You're just too proud to admit it. Believe whatever you want. It doesn't matter. I stopped caring what any of you think, and you're all gonna be stuck in that jar no matter what. Work? Well, no. I had to try though, didn't I?
does it feel, Wanda, to be helpless? To know that you can change nothing? Not great, right? This isn't you. You wouldn't do this. You wouldn't hurt us like this. Guess we never knew each other at all. dream of. I brought you into this world, and now I'm taking you out of it! No clay pools here, Scully! Nowhere to hide! It's just you and me! Can save you now! 